Throughout the school year, one second grade class here at Mount View Elementary in Corvallis has been using the idea of flexible seating, which allows the kids to change up their seating arrangements and type of seating throughout the day to find out what might be best for them during that time. After nearly 40 years of buying up portions of this historic timber town of Tiller, the Caswell family is ready to sell their 250 acres for nearly $4 million. But they and local residents want to make sure that whoever buys it helps bring it back to life. After last night's record rain, it didn't take long for these muddy rapids to rise out of their banks. Water so powerful and not only flooded roads, but moved debris like this hundreds of yards away. Start fast or get left behind. That has been the emphasis so far this season for the Oklahoma offense. One of the guys leading that charge is wideout Sterling Shepard. But the jobs that they created for this construction won't last long. Construction will finish up and the crews will pack up and move on. But the seats that they added to the stadium will have a lasting impact on the city and the university. From behind the fence, police didn't know what the man had. Could have been a gun or a knife. Turns out it was only a cell phone. Folks here in Cleveland County are stuck between a road and a hard place. The floodwaters have washed out so many of the roads that emergency crews can't get in and some folks can't get out. They say the grass is always greener on the other side, but on the other side of this yard, neighbors say the grass needs work. Walls are coming down and excitement fills the air. The newest expansion to Oklahoma Memorial Stadium began just a few months ago. And by the beginning of next football season, the south end zone will be looking a lot like this. But the added seats don't just magically appear. Dr. Bob Doffenbach explains how many jobs have been created from the construction. The, the impacts of construction spending in terms of jobs tend to produce about 50% higher total impact. So if you're talking 700 jobs, let's say, well, 50% higher would take you above the 1,000 level. But the jobs that they created for this construction won't last long. Construction will finish up and the crews will pack up and move on. But the seats that they added to the stadium will have a lasting impact on the city and the university. You get people coming from all over. Some of them uh, spend extra time here, extra dollars in not just Norman, but Oklahoma City. So that's the imported part, which makes the big differential in, uh, in the economic impact for the area. The crews are hard at work getting preliminary construction done for the support beams. And once the final whistle for the season has been blown, they will move in and begin connecting the south end zone to the rest of the stadium. Tyler Jones, OU Nightly.